Hey guys, how are you? <laughs> Back again and showing you actually the wrap up. We're all done with our food prep. All I have to do is really put it away. And also we're just about getting ready for dinner. And I wanted to show you that salmon that I did with the pineapple and show you how it came out. So that's the first thing I'm gonna do right here is open this up. Oh, look at that. That looks lovely. Look at, I don't know if you can see that. You see that? That look pretty. So that is salmon with pineapple. A little bit of um, shallots, and I put a little rosemary underneath and um, onion just to give it a little additional flavor, which I'm gonna just leave here. Um, and that's actually gonna be our dinner tonight. Let me open up this other one and I'll show you the finished product. It smells so good. We love salmon anyway, and just love the way salmon smells. Um, love the way it tastes. Oh, oh my goodness, look at that. Let me move this out of the way. Rinse in my hands. Here we go. So this is our dinner tonight. We're having some broccoli, sweet potato. Instead of the strawberries, we're tying in our pineapple theme with the pineapple from the, uh, the salmon and this really nicely poached salmon and parchment. So that is dinner tonight. Let me move this out of the way and I will give you a real quick rundown on some of our food prep um, that's already been done. So we have our salads, which is one of our lunches with those, um, the, uh, the, actually the clean chicken with, uh, these chicken were marinated in a little bit of a touch of oil with fresh basil, some uh, lime zest and orange zest and then they were cooked on the grill and they're just uh, packaged up into little uh, serving containers here and then I have a salad there's a little bit of um, baby romaine some uh, shredded spinach some carrot a uh, half-baked potato chopped uh, raw cashews the dressing and then this and we have them all set and ready to go uh, for John and I for two lunches this week uh, these are our berries. I spent some time this morning. I just went through, I, I wash everything. And so I have all of our berries all set up. I have, I bought berries a week before. So these are, the, these are those, so I'll use those first. And then I have the other ones in here. These are actually the uh, blueberries. We've got some nice strawberries. These are beautiful strawberries. Um, all washed, cleaned, dried, and now put in here. Um, and I believe these are the blackberries, and I have the raspberries, are in a, a small amount of them. There's some blackberries. So we have our mixed berries that we're gonna make for, um, to go with our yogurt in the morning. These are part of our snack. They're already portioned out. There's um, six pieces of uh, tur turkey, the nit nitrate-free turkey breast, and then the nitrate-free um, ham. That'll be part of our, our lunch, or actually our snacks. And then, those pork chops with the Cajun, actually the slap your mama um, Cajun spice, well that's right here. And then uh, this is with the asparagus with the pork chops. We have a lot of pork chops this week because we're not doing lamb chops. Uh, and this is basically the same thing with some broccoli. And then this is the tilapia. So the tilapia we have, uh, one night we'll have it with um, the asparagus and another night we'll have it with the zoodles, with the zucchini noodles and again the big uh, potato, the half-baked potato, are with all of those. So those are all set and ready to go. I'll cover those up, put them in the fridge. Um, we have our lunch for a couple of the days during the week. We have that on one day, and then the uh, opposite days are these mason jar salads. The dressing I have in a little container on the top here, and what will go with this, so these are parsnips that I roasted, and then this is um, the portion of pork that we're gonna have with that. Mine are actually already set, and my lunch is all set for tomorrow. It's in that bag uh, with all my snacks and all the other stuff that go with. So those are all there. I had some extra parsnips because we I need to do some more food prep on Thursday for, thir for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So I have some parsnips already ready for that. I have some sweet potato ready for that, and I have some uh, grilled chicken uh, ready for that. So... We're pretty much good to go with our food prep. We're all set, we're all done, and we're good to go with our dinner. But I just wanted to jump back in and show you the finished product. Um, it really is easy to do, and this is what sets us up for success. Um, if you have questions or you have you know anything 
that you that you want to know um, how to make it or uh, what what I have, just give me a uh, give me a call. Sure, give me a call, um, or just send me a message, um, and I'm happy to help you out if you uh, you know uh, need a recipe or um, or want some ideas uh, on food planning. We're doing a particular program, which we really love the food plan for that. Um, and it's something that can we can adapt easily into our lifestyle. So we're following a pretty uh, strict program for these three weeks. We're, we're going into the second week starting tomorrow. But there are so many variations that we can do which help us to maintain that. And it's all real food. There's no, it's not a diet. This is a lifestyle. We're making lifestyle changes. Uh, and this is all part of it. And I know that lots of people out there want to do the same thing. And that's why we share it. Uh, because uh, we know that there are people out there who are doing the same thing and may not be doing the same program, may not be doing what we do, but, um, but want to live a healthy lifestyle. So uh, that's, that's what we got. So anyway, have a good Sunday. Have a good evening. Take care.